up in the box, baseball fans. Welcome back to another episode. We've got 2023 Tops Update Blaster Boxes. We're running a 40-box blaster case. This is episode 5 of 10. We're doing four tonight. Let's dig the cleats in. Let's hit a nuke. Tom Paul just joined in. Looking for those jack-o'-lantern rares, ghosts, ultra rares, mummies out of 50, black cat out of 10, witch hat out of 5, and the elusive 101 bat. And not a baseball bat. How's everybody doing this Friday? Took Tracker to the vet today. Poor guy has a pretty bad infection. Clifford's in the house, but he'll be all right. <laughs> Kiwi says, the sea bat. I don't want to say that. YouTube might suppress... And right off the rip, we got a Gunner Foil. That's nice. Debut Gunner Henderson Rainbow Foil. Hobby News Daily. KC Car Connection. I saw you pulled. We have a gold here. I saw you pulled a Wander Auto. Wander was reinstated on the 40-man roster. Don't know what that means, but... He could be back next year. We'll find out. Down the road. Wander Mania. Is Wander going to be back? Michael Bush. We've got Bush. The Jack-O-Lantern rare. Mike is in the box. P. Mendoza. Kiwi cards. The Nibbles. What's happening, guys and girls? If you're a female, comment. We don't get too many... Females in the channel, it's like 1%. My mom being one of them. I know Nancy's out there. I forgot who else. And there's Bryce Miller. <laughs> and who do we have here? The Halloween Parallels. Theory of Dunis on an autograph, home field advantage, um, or heavy lumber. We have hit it SSP. We've hit some numbered Halloween parallels. But we've hit none of those other ones. There's Andy Pettit, Ace of Diamonds, Adley Rutschman. I, I do like this product for the price that I got them at, $19.00. Per blaster. So I'm okay at that price. I didn't realize how much complete sets were going for. <laughs> Kells Peak says the 1% is your mom. What would there be like 70 females that watch total? Speaking of which, we're getting close. We're getting close to that 8,000 subscriber range. If you're new, we're going to be opening a lot of product in November and December. What do you want for Christmas? Thanksgiving is coming up. Next thing you know, Black Friday will be in the house. I have a feeling this year, guys, Black Friday is going to have some big deals on sports cards on Top's website, on Blowout, at your local stores. LeClerc, he was in the playoffs. World Series winner. The Padres are in financial troubles. I saw that Nibbles are selling off. Don said these blasters are insane. What's going on, Midwest Sports Cards? And Juan. But again, happy Friday night. We're going to keep open. We're getting... We're getting close to getting through this. There's Volpe on the insert, 88 insert, Garrett Cole. You get a lot of those all-star game inserts. Compared to hangers, lots of all-star game inserts. Eddie's in the house. What's up, bro? Me and Eddie have a PSA order that's probably going to be back by Thanksgiving. Looks like we have a Chrome Stars MLB. A little Chrome Dome. I did see Will Smith won his third um, World Series. 
Your team should go out and sign Will Smith. Dansby Swanson. Michael Harris on the Action Stars. Here's a rookie, Nolan Gorman. Take Nolan on the debut. Base version. Wait till you guys see the full recap of this. I have been just top-loading so many cards from these blasters. The ultimate nickel and dime. Box two coming up. Are you getting Topps Chrome update? I am not going to spend the money on that. Uh-oh. Eddie got some prestige megas. Good luck, Eddie and the boys. Uh, no Topps Chrome update. Buyback. I just feel like the price for Topps Chrome update is not good. You can get 2023 Chrome for the same price almost on Hobbies. Here's a numbered card. Ooh, and it's a Gunner. There we go. Gunner Henderson, purple, rookie debut. Debut. Bam. Wham, bam. Thank you. Gunner. Any numbered Gunner is a good numbered Gunner. So far, this is a nice opening right off the bat. No pun intended. All-Star Game, Nolan Arenado. Tatis on the insert. Now we're starting to hit some rookie debuts. We did not hit that stuff in the... Um, we did not hit that stuff in the hangers. Yeah, the Gunner and the um, Corbin Carroll. Those are probably the ones you want. Although I would take some... Uh, Cubby's Parallels, David Wright and Big Meat Pete on the tandems. What's going on, JB? Not JB Pritzker watching from Illinois, are you? <laughs> that would be funny. Kleiny Man is in the house. We got another one of these chromes. So you get a chrome in these. You get a lot of all-star game inserts. You get those few Halloween inserts. There's Mike um, McGill Vargas, not Michael. Austin Riley all-star game. And then there's that. Rookie Chrome. Um, I just saw that Bellinger declined that mutual option. Um, I just think he's probably worth more money. Somebody's going to pay him a lot of money. I don't mind paying Cody Bellinger, you know, 20 to $25 million a year. But how many years do you want to give him? I'd give him four years, $100 million, But... I would not want to do like a seven or eight year contract on him. What player are you going to get? A stud or a dud? Yeah, they made blasters great, JB. Blasters are pretty darn good if you ask me. Again, for 19 bucks, I'm pretty pleased with these for $19. Rookie, Jake Alou. Riley Green, be a parallel. Mm, no. We've not had a parallel on one of these yet either. And to be quite honest with you, Cubs, Cubs need pitching. Cubs need a lot of pitching. Little blue. Jake Alou. And there's a hop on the base version. Snell's going to, yeah, dude, Padres are going to lose all those guys. They're going to sell like sell off like the um, Marlins. Cubs are a little bit pitching breath. Yeah, they have a lot of young dudes, but we need, a, we need a number one, man. We need a one. And we need bullpen help badly. And I don't trust young pitchers who just have done it and haven't proven it. You can never have too many pitchers.
Oh, all-star game, Tucker. Yeah, Trout still at 37 million a year for the next seven years. See, like, those, that is not going to end good at, towards the end. Steele looks like a number one, I agree. But is he going to keep doing that? That's the key. He hasn't proven it yet. I'd like to get somebody to go with him. Um, Stroman's a free agent too, I believe. There's this off is gonna be fun with the with all the players. There's a ton of players that are gonna be on the move. The Juan Soto stuff heated up real quick, man. The rumors on him going to the Cubs, the Yankees, Astros, you name it, man. And then you got Otani, the number one. Tom Paul says, how's the school year going? It's been all right. Boba Shett, all-star game blue. That's a cool-looking card right there. Bo knows, baby. Look at that. Blue. That's our first parallel in the all-star games. Man, that looks nice. Mad Wife Rip says Freed is a after 2024. Philly's got I agree, man. Philly's got Har uh, Harper for an absolute steal. Me and my buddy were talking about that. Because when he was a free agent, I was hoping the Cubs would sign him. Everybody hates Harper for some reason. I don't understand why. I love Bryce Harper. The dude just gets on base no matter how bad he's hitting. He's a great player. But again, happy Friday night. We're on that road to 8,000 subscribers. We got update down the road. I have some Logo Fractor videos that I'll be uploading when I get a chance. Derek Cheater, cool one. Lots of Jeter power collectors. I'll put that in the uh, top load pile. Come on. Ooh, we got a um, jack-o'-lantern rare. I didn't see who it was. I just saw the jack-o'-lanterns. And then a chrome. That is Taj Bradley. And who is it? Sean Murphy on the jack-o'-lantern. Those are tough hits. Those are tough hits. At the end of the case, like I said, we'll do a breakdown and we'll see how many of those we pull. You think Jock Jung is going to be a great player? He looks like it, Jonathan. JB said he used to think Harper was a jerk. But he's he, he just plays, man. Luis Arias, and he had a great start to the year. Jeff said he's turned himself into Captain America. Dude, how cool would it be if Tops combined with like Marvel or DC to do a themed version of a superhero set? Now we're talking. Rookie. Caleb Hamilton. That would be interesting. Rookie card, Bryce Miller. Now we're talking. Hey, Tops, if you're out there and you see a video of Step in the Box, I'm for hire. If you want to take me on to your Creative team. <laughs> Joy Ortiz. I'm sure the Angels would love to trade Trout, but I don't think they can. I don't know if any... I think you'd have to pull a... Um, I think you'd have to pull a... Whatchamacallit? A Nolan Arenado where you buy a bunch of his contract... That is true. I forgot about Upper Deck and Marvel. 
Well, I'm sure the way Fanatics goes, they could uh, buy them out too. Clover pulled a red Chrome Stars MLB. Dang. Odds are crazy. And this is our last box. Happy Friday night. Gonna watch some Gold Rush. Never thought I'd be using baby wipes to wipe a dog's butt. But that's what I gotta do. Call me the big daddy of Tracker. Poor guy. He got some cream and ointment too. JB says, SSP coming up. Um, we got a Michael Waka on the green Ice Ice Baby Foil. Michael Waka. So, so far we had a nice Gunner Purple. On the debut, we've had a lot of nickel and dime small stuff. Again, I'll do a full recap on this. Would you like to have your own baseball card, Brett? I would, Jonathan, actually. That'd be pretty fun. McGill Amaya, Chapman. There is Hunter Green. And we have a rookie for the Brewers. Brewers have a lot of guys in the set. If you could get into blaster case breaks for the Brewers... They have a lot of guys in this set. The Brew Crew. I haven't heard what Craig Council, he, he interviewed for the Mets, I believe. Trekker rules get better, it says the Nibbles. Jeff says, what's next? We talked about this last night. I actually think 4th of July parallels would be amazing. I would love that. Hot dogs, rockets, stars and stripes. What else would you put on the on a theme of like this Halloween on a parallel of red, white, and blue? Stars. But yeah, these blasters are good. I like these. There's a Bernard on the rookie. Again, last box here, retail blue. You get a fair amount of retail blues. Rainbow full every now and then. Yuri Perez for the fish on the debut. Look at all these cards. There's another rookie. And is this another parallel of this? Is this a... Nope, just turn around. My minor pile is starting to get big. Clifford says Speedos. <laughs> Wendy Peppercorn on the uh, on the bathing suit. America parallel. Do you still have your national sparkle cards? Um, I sold. I have a few coming back from um, PSA on those. I sold a bunch of stuff, guys. A few weeks ago. A ton, I oh mean, like tons, almost all my stuff. Not my PC stuff, but all the other stuff. Huge, huge sale. Big, keeps the wheels turning over here. The bus goes round and round. Rookie Taj Bradley. St. Patrick's Day would be pretty cool. I think Lucky Peter would love that one. And here it is, the last pack on this Friday night. Last pack mojo. I also hope the Cubs do not trade Chris Morrell. His name keeps popping up. I love Chris Morrell. Sanga, Ramirez, and there you have it. We end that. Let's do a little recap. Again, when this case is done, we'll do a full 40-box recap. All right. Here were some of these. Uh, the nickel and dime pile, as usual. 
You, it just seems like you get way more inserts out of blasters than you do hangers. Clifford says, does that guy travel? <laughs> Andy, I wouldn't buy them unless you're getting a um, a really good deal, like 18, 19 bucks a piece. Sanga, Taj Bradley Rainbow Foil, Perez Retail Blue, Bernard Halloween Rookie, Jordan Walker Insert, 88 Insert, Montesterio on the Rookie Halloween, Miller Rookie Halloween, Hamilton Rookie Retail Blue, Stars MLB Chrome Bradley. We had a Sean Murphy, Jack O' Lantern Rare, Derek Jeter on the '88, Logan O'Hoppy on the rookie debut, Jake Alou Blue Retail Blue, Vargas Chrome, Harris Rookie, Nolan Gorman Rookie debut on the Halloween, Volpe '88, Andy Pettit Ace of Diamonds, Ad Adley Rutschman All Star Game, man, just. Tons of nickel and dime. I'm not sure what kind of deal you can get at Barnes & Noble with a discount there. And then here's the big hit of this break right here. Gunnar Henderson. Michael Bush on the Jack Lantern Rare. Those are not numbered. Gunner, Rainbow Fall. Nice little match here. Little AL Rookie of the Year, Amir Garrett on the gold. Riley Green, Retail Blue, Bo Bichette. And then the Ice Ice Baby Michael Walker. So that is the fewest amount of number cards we've had yet. Fewest amount of number, only three and four boxes, but we had that blue, which is pretty cool, Bo. And I like the Gunner. That was interesting. Uh, this, that's by far the lowest number we had. What do you think Gunner Purple will go for? I really don't know, Andy. I'm not sure. But that's definitely by far the best hit of all of them. Appreciate you guys. We'll do a leather, another live on Saturday and Sunday. We'll keep going through this case four boxes at a time. Please like subscribe, share, comment below. Until next time, peace.